بسم الله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله. Okay, let's continue. We are practically in the last session in this project. The what we have to speak about today is, I guess, I have some remarks, some notes about the the conclusion. Okay, this is the final project, the final manuscript. And in the final manuscript, I read the conclusion, uh, and I have some, uh, I have, uh, I have some remarks here. Uh, the the, uh, the the remark here is the same about uh, the introduction. The the, the uh, in the first one, in the first one, in the first plate, we told this. We talked about the introduction, and the, the, uh, I remember the main uh, the main remark is the introduction. The, the, the introduction the, the introduction was too broad, too broad. Sma kiman gulu am abziv. The conclusion and the introduction they should be concerning, attached to the manuscript, to the thesis. Uh, what does that mean? Uh, when we read the, the, here, we have futuristic project. It, it's too broad. In, the, in this conclusion, uh, you are not talking about the manuscript. You are not talking about the main point, uh, what we did in your project. And this is uh, very important. They, they are too broad. For instance, here, in conclusion, this is um, embark on a depth exploration. This is too broad. In, in the uh, introduction and the conclusion, you have to uh, to enumerate, to remember, to talk about what what effectively you did in your project. For instance, uh, in the conclusion, uh, this part in in the first part, you can be proud. In this part, it's okay to be broad and talk that the project was a project about hardware, etc., etc. We call that the uh, the context phase. In the first place, in the first paragraph, you are uh, we are talking broadly about our project, but in the other part, you need to go to the project to talk about the project for instance in this part you can enumerate the main the main works we did for instance you can say in our thesis we studied megatron and we implemented in chisel we have we done many tests etc you have to enumerate what you did what we did in this place, you can see it's broad. Uh, this project also shed light on need of more advanced software tools requiring development. In any case, here you are talking about what we did. You have to talk about what you did. You have to summary. In the conclusion, you have to summary the main point, the main works we did in our project. If you summarize the main project, what we did, you can summarize, for instance. Uh, we studied in the chapter one. We studied the hardware, the uh, sorry, the uh, digital design computer architecture. We studied the uh, the simulation. Uh, how we call that? Logic simulation. We studied the uh, the HDL. We uh, studied Gigatron. We studied Megatron. We tried to implement. You, uh, you tried to implement Megatron with Gigatron. We tested all those points. Are the main works uh, should be put here? They should be put here. They should be put here. And the last paragraph, you can uh, talk about uh, the uh, the experience you gained in this project. You can say, for instance, in this project, we uh, lear learned that Chisel is a good, uh, a better way 
to use HDL in the sense of testing and easiness and use of high level language which is more uh, simply than low level language like uh, Verilog and uh, VHDL uh, you can talk about the uh, the tests that you done the the the, uh, the, the, e the, the, the easy way to implement the test etc uh, etc et anyway you have to to uh, in, in in this uh, in this part you have to, to 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 talk about your main experience your your own experience what you get in this uh, what you get in this project and what you have learned using these tools, these new tools and uh, this new field for you, this new field, how the hardware uh, uh, can, be, uh, can be done using high level languages and uh, the tests, etc, etc. This is, this is the, main, uh, the main remark, this is the main remark. Uh, and uh, the last point, the last point you can add, for instance, uh, what we call, uh, it's well-known uh, point, uh, what we call perspective. It's inside the conclusion. The, the perspective is uh, if you had much more time, what would you prefer to do, to continue? What uh, you would prefer to continue? Uh, for instance, uh, the, uh, the, the implementation of uh, an algorithm or the, the, the construction of a proper software to or, or a small uh, operating system or a monitor like it was the first, uh, if you remember, the, the first uh, objective, the first uh, main objective is the creation of monitor. This is in three or four lines you have talked about the perspective. The perspective is, is the continuation. What is the continuation of this project? It's not finished yet. What is the co continuation for this kind of uh, project. This is how we construct uh, a general conclusion. A general conclusion is constructed this way. This way. Uh, do you have questions? It's clear. You have uh, just to, you have just to uh, rewrite this. You can, uh, for, for, for instance, this, this part, the first part, can be broke. You can put something broke. But the, the, what's left should be retouched, should be concerning what you did, what you did in the, the project in the manuscript. I think that's all. Do you have other questions aside from, apart from uh, the manuscript? Uh, okay, uh, Absalem? Mm -hmm. uh, it's, it's a counter, yes, it's a counter. Uh, it's a counter, but it's not the, uh, the same job, it's not the, the job of uh, the, the, the X, it's not uh, like PC. PC is an address used to access the, the program inside the ROM. X is used as uh, inside the, uh, used by the MAU, MAU to generate an address uh, on, uh, on, the RAM, on the RAM. They are different in the uh, first in the size. The size of PC is 16 bit and the size of X is 8 bit. They are different and the user are different. The, uh, the, the PC the, is uh, to point to the instruction, the X is uh, to point to a data. And uh, why it, it was in this architecture, it was implemented as a counter, normally it would be a simple, a simple register. But in this architecture it was uh, used, implemented as a counter because it is used mainly to display the pixels. When it's, it's used to, to browse, to browse a table for parkourir. La table, la table, fiha les pixels. 
This is, this is main use, it is a, this is a specific use. It was designed, the architecture was designed this way. So, uh, uh, this, uh, it was designed this way. Why? Because it is used, the main purpose, the main purpose, the main purpose of this uh, register is to display the pixels, is to contain the address where in the RAM uh, to display the pixels, the pixels of the architecture. Do you have other uh, questions? No. Uh, we have to stop here. Okay. We stop here. Rabbi uh, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Rabbi Alam Shukran. Shukran Jazian. Shukran Baraka Baraka Allah. I will Mm. Yes, yes, thank you. Uh, take your time, take your time. It's not, uh, you can take your time, uh, like usual, like usual, you will send me the, uh, the manuscripts by email. Uh, Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Rabbi Aoukh. Shukran, shukran.